In this video, I'll show you a free computer program that runs AIs similar to ChatGPT locally on your computer. You can turn off your internet and this AI still works. And because all the data is processed locally, you don't need to worry about privacy either. This software is called Chan AI. And in this video, I'll show you what you can do with it, some of its advantages and disadvantages, and also how you can set it up on your computer. Let's get started. When you open Jan AI, you'll notice there is quite a bit of similarity to ChatGPT. In the middle, there is a big chat box where you can enter your prompt and get a response from the AI. On the right, there are a few settings and on the left, you have a list of threads. On the far left, you also see a narrow menu bar where you can choose between thread, which is basically the chat communications that we just saw. And then there is a hop which allows you to add different language models to this software. You can also see the system monitor and settings in the lower left corner, but I don't think you really need those. So far, I've tried two different Mistral language models and the Llama model from Meta, and all of them deliver quite good results. I'd say from a performance level, it's quite comparable to GPT 3.5 which is what you get on ChatGPT if you use it for free. Now let's talk about some of the advantages and disadvantages of Chan. Chan is an open source program, which means it's free and it will remain free. And because it works offline, it's very convenient and your privacy is ensured. Chan also comes with some disadvantages though. During the time I used it, it experienced several crashes and also, because it's running on your computer, it will use your computer processor and take away from the computer performance while it's running. It's also not on the same level as GPT-4, the highest end version of ChatGPT, but only comparable to 3.5, the free version, as I mentioned earlier. I would, however, expect significant improvements in all of these problem areas during this year. Next, let me show you how you can use Chan AI yourself. It's very easy and doesn't require any code. First, go to chan.ai, then click on download Chan for PC and just download it for your operating system. Follow all the instructions of the installation menu. And once it's installed, all you need to do is choose one of the language models and download it. They are roughly five gigabytes, so that might take a few minutes. And as soon as that's done, you are ready to go and start chatting. Again, the software is still a bit unstable, so expect a bit shaky results also on your computer. And also while the software is running, you might not necessarily be able to run other software very smoothly next to it. And that was Chan AI. If you try it out yourself, Please let me know in the comments what you think and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!